Hello world, Lockpicking Dev here. Today I have a Master Lock 90 DSPT trigger lock. It is about $11.23 on Amazon. It is a four standard pin uh, pin tumbler lock, which is a little different uh, compared to like, you know, a lot of other locks like this one, which has uh, wafer pins in it, or it uses wafers. And uh, the uh, body is made of steel and zinc, so a uh, nice strong body on it. Uh, let's see here the internal here the way it locks is works by um, this bolt like uh, yeah this bolt right in right in there and so the key you turn that bolt and when you turn it you see the threads are gone and that's how it detaches from over here so the bolt goes into that metal plate right there so it threads into that so, key out here. Let me stick this into that way. You can see how they'll latch in together. Like that. And then when we turn it, the threads are no longer touching and it comes apart. Before we continue, as always, always make sure your firearm is unloaded. I have my magazine out. There are no shells in there. And uh, let's go ahead and put this on, show how it works. So it doesn't fit all guns as per their, uh, uh, what they say on Amazon, but I did find it fits mine. There we go, nice and tight. So one thing you wanna do once you have it on is you wanna to try to actually turn it. See if there's anything you can do to make that move. Let's go ahead and cock it. Can't even cock it all the way because of the trigger guard. That's good. Perfect. So we know that's good. So this one does work well for this specific trigger. This is a CZ75 compact. It's going to see it works nice and well there. So let's go ahead and see how easy it is to pick off now. And I'm not going to turn it that way. Unloaded or not, you never point a firearm at anything you don't intend to kill. Here we go. So it goes like pin three there. Yep. Two. There. Awkward angle. Under that pin, so yeah, four feels set. Two feels fine. One. Got one now. Two's good. Get up there. And three. This is a new pick of mine. So, give me a little break. There we go. It was three way up there. And now we have it open. Which, yeah, makes sense. We can see three was way up there. So now we can take it apart. And there we go. So, overall, the, um, the strength of the body is a plus. The, um... It's not a typical wafer lock. Um, it does cover the trigger pretty well that we saw. So that is another plus. And uh, otherwise, I mean, just four standard pins, um, pin tumbler lock. And uh, that was the Master 90 DSPT. When you are shopping for gun locks, please test them out on the unloaded firearm and make sure they work really well. And uh, Please, everyone, be safe. All right. Thanks for watching.